Hey guys, hope you're having a blessed day. God bless you all and remember the love of Jesus. Today, I'm gonna to be telling you guys about my time on the A340 Virgin Atlantic economy. Yeah, you heard me right, Airbus A340. Those things are dated, but it'll be fun. This was back in 2018. We flew from London Heathrow to Atlanta, Hartford, Jackson. It was quite a flight. We always enjoy. Here's a little bit of footage of London quickly, right before I took the flight. Uh, I was about 12 years old, so bear with me. This is your highlights from my 2018 United Kingdom trip. Here's Canterbury. There's Cathedral. London, if I've not already said, it's my favorite city. Back in 18, though, the Big Ben was going under a lot of construction, so I couldn't really see it. There's the famous Notting Hill, and the best part, afternoon tea. Most days are pretty gray. Can be windy as well. The underground is very convenient. It takes you all around the city. Here's Cambridge. That was a very awesome cathedral. Now, here is my Virgin Atlantic A340 review. Enjoy. So we departed our flight out of Terminal 3, which is Virgin Atlantic's terminal. Served us a good drink of orange juice, and we got a pret a manger before. As you can see, the screens are a little older. The seats were nice. The food was actually really good as well. I got the chicken and pasta. Cake thing is really good. And you guys know that afternoon tea is my absolute favorite. And Virgin Atlantic always gives these little candies and chips. Like I said, the 340 was a little outdated because that thing was the only thing that controlled the touch screens. Great snacks were provided on the flight. Landed at the world's biggest airport, Atlanta, in the International Terminal. Passport line actually coming in from England. It's very nice. And I hope you guys enjoyed this dated review. Thank you for watching my Virgin Atlantic review. Now here's a big review of England. Enjoy. Tishoom is a really good Indian restaurant they have all over England. Along with Russ Pomodoro, Pizza Pilgrim, and Honest Burger. The O2 Arena was also a very neat experience. As you can see the shard behind me. Buying a sausage here in the Borough Market. So good. It's Windsor Castle. This was in my hotel called the Ham Yard. Amazing hotel. Firmdale was the best. As I mentioned earlier, Fortnum and Mason is also a must. Along with the amazing afternoon tea at the Covent Garden Hotel. It's a British Museum. You guys like my UK umbrella? It doesn't help it's raining too, but it's very mild. The rain showers here are not too heavy usually, so yeah, don't cancel your trip over a little rain. Eastbourne, United Kingdom. The bus in Eastbourne to the cliffs was very fun. Cliffs. Also, the Cotswolds are an absolute must. This is my favorite look. So nice. 
Those are in and lower slaughter. Can you tell how wet it is behind me? It's raining pretty hard. The towns in the causeway were extremely quaint. Lots of peaceful neighborhood walks. It was the best. Though the weather was sometimes cloudy and a little rainy, it was still very enjoyable. Very classic city of London. Love it. Other day trips include Oxford, Cambridge, and Bath. And with that said, hope you guys enjoyed my tour of England. I'm sorry it's not just a Virgin Atlantic video, but I kind of wanted to add my experience on my favorite city in the world, which is London. Guys, the community is growing so fast. I'm beyond blessed. And thank you so much, guys, for joining the community. I was not expecting anything, but man, this growth is insane. I mean, thank you guys so much again, and we'll see you guys in the future. God bless.